Nassau groupers are endangered throughout the Caribbean. They and other reef fishes aggregate to spawn at special sites along the reef. Belize has enacted important legislation that will conserve these sites and help sustain viable fishing and tourism industries. The legislation protects 12 spawning sites as marine reserves which are close to fishing all year round. These sites are Rocky Point, Marga Key, Dog Flea Key, Sandbor, Key Bokel, South Point, Emily or Key Glory, Northeast Point Glovers, Gladden Spit, Nicholas Key, Rise and Fall Bank and Seal Key. A closed season for the Nassau Grouper has also been enacted from 1st December to 31st March of the following year. No Nassau Grouper less than 20 inches and greater than 30 inches in total length can be caught. The Fisheries Department along with the Spawning Aggregation Working Group partners has been monitoring many of the sites for 10 years to assess their recovery now that they are protected. Dr. Leandra Cho Ricketts, Chair of the Spawning Aggregation Working Group, has led the analysis of data collected over this period. The data is showing us from what we have from the seven sites we've been monitoring is that two sites really stand out there in terms of numbers. Um, San Borki and Northeast Point Glovers, they still have fish aggregating in between 2,000 to 3,000 fish. And at these sites, what's different is that they have very good patrols, sustained patrols during the spawning period. When we compare that to another site like Emily in the south, or there's another one, Marquis in Turnef, for several years there wasn't any patrols, effective patrols, and so the numbers fell, or they almost disappeared. So in order to keep managing these sites, we need to keep monitoring the numbers at spawning, but we also need to ensure that we have effective patrols during the spawning or the cold season.